Um, so hello everyone. Uh, my name is Neha and uh, I welcome you all to the platform of Eduite. Today we have Atul with us and he would be sharing his interview experience. So hi Atul, how are you? Hello Neha, I'm good. How are you? I'm good as well. Uh, so Atul, uh, would you please introduce yourself to our audience? Okay Neha. So thank you for inviting me at this platform. So as you all know, my name is Atul Singh Rana and uh, currently I'm pursuing my bachelor's in chemical engineering. I'm in fourth year uh, from Dr. B.R. Ambedkar NIT Jalandhar. Recently I have been placed at uh, Reliance Industries Limited. So yeah, so Atul, uh, what was the position that you were placed at? Uh, they offered me as a graduate engineer trainee role, GET role at uh, their company. Okay. Yeah. And uh, how many rounds were there? So it consisted of uh, three rounds. The first round was the online assessment test, then the uh, group discussion, and finally the personal interview. Okay. okay. And what were their platforms? So the for the online assessment, they, the platform was uh, like their own platform was there uh, and uh, for the group discussion and uh, like a personal interview uh, it was held on uh, ms teams okay uh, can you mention like uh, some of the topics or questions that were there okay so uh, if i come to the online assessment program online assessment test so it consisted of yeah. two parts first was the general aptitude and the second was uh, our technical question from the chemical engineering so if we come to the general aptitude part so it consisted of, of basic quant section like uh, time speed distance question some of the percentage questions and uh, also some logarithmic and uh, like uh, the pie charts question and etc and uh, some logical questions were also there and coming to the verbal ability section there were also some like paragraph questions some synonyms antonyms and this was all like general aptitude part and if we come to the technical questions like uh, for chemical engineering uh, like the basic concepts of uh, heat transfer thermodynamics and uh, mass transfer theory like they were considered all the subjects some some parts like basic questions were there uh, how did, and how did you prepare for these um, topics and parts? So honestly, I would say that um, I was, uh, I have the idea like what type of question would be asked. So I was uh, uh, like, I practiced it earlier only. So how did I prepare that uh, some YouTube channels I like followed? Like everything is uh, available on the internet. So nothing to say like... Yeah. Uh, just to follow this, follow this. But yeah, if any candidate want to follow prior to their interview or prior to their assessment, they can follow like the famous website indiabix.com. They like uh, cover all the questions of general aptitude. Also, if uh, you would ask like general, uh, like group discussion topics, they also yeah. provide those group discussion topics. So like indiabix.com is the like good site to yeah. be prepared. Uh, I'm asking that after GD, what followed was interview or that, that yeah, was yeah 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 it was a personal interview last yeah so yeah okay so how did your interview uh, proceed what were the questions asked okay so uh, first of all like uh, if uh, i will start from the group discussion actually the yes. group discussion took part in two uh, two rounds like uh, first was for the petrochemical and second was the manufacturing these two uh, like uh, sections were divided by them so only like uh, only the, uh, the the there were three groups actually in the group discussion for the petrochemical so only one group was uh, selected from it for the petrochemical interview and other two groups was for manufacturing interview so luckily i was in both of them inter both of the interview like in petrochemical also like in manufacturing also so in both the interview like they asked about the uh, first initial question like introduce yourself uh, and afterwards they asked my like what are my hobbies and uh, uh, what are my strengths and weaknesses they yes. also focused about some of the question three to four questions were about uh, the, my technical portion from chemical engineering like uh, in thermodynamics they asked about my car not cycle uh, like yes. uh, in heat transfer the heat transfer basic concepts of heat transfer and uh, also like pumps from the fluid mechanics like uh, like the practical approach one question was that like uh, uh, 
uh, if the pump is not working, what would your first step to solve that issue? So like basic question were asked. And at last they also um, asked me about like, uh, uh, what, did you, what do you expect from Reliance? That uh, what position or in what sectors do you want to uh, come in that into the Reliance? So like by this question, they want to check like, uh, how are you interested in that company like have you uh, have you done any research about uh, reliance industries limited before coming to the interview so like both of the interviews like this only uh, so atul uh, well you sound uh, pretty confident to me but uh, was there a moment uh, when you felt really nervous any time during the interview See. before or after yeah if uh, I would come to the part of the nervousness, actually, I have gone through two to three interview prior to the Reliance interview also. So, yeah. like, I would not deny the fact that I wasn't nervous at all. There was a little bit of nervousness uh, inside me. So, like, a little bit of not that much nervousness that I would ruin my interview. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. So, like, uh, did you do anything? anything particular to uh, like get over your nervousness or you just let it be nothing i like uh, be myself <laughs> so yeah. nothing special <laughs> like only just i um, have my basics in my mind that i how i would like uh, get deliver my points uh, in front of yeah. that person who is taking my interview so nothing is special okay. well being yourself is a pretty good idea as well Okay, uh, yeah. so I thought, uh, like any other any other tips that you would like to give to our audience? Uh, if I come to the tips, like uh, first of all, be confident because as far as I like uh, share my experience that uh, the uh, interviewer who is taking our interview just focus is kept focus is keeping his focus on your confidence is keeping your focus on your like how are you delivering your points. The question he's asking how are you delivering your how much clear your voice is how much clarity in your topics in your basics is so like uh, like uh, they don't expect you that you know everything uh what whatever you know uh, how much uh, you know just deliver with your confidence and clarity in your mind just on it okay that's great so this about sums it up uh thank you atul it was it was a pleasure having you with us Thank you so much.